So I've written the new theme song for Civilization VI, which plays underneath the opening movie and the main menu. And the song is called Sogno di Volare, which is Italian for the dream of flight. There are a lot of ways to summon the feeling of motion in music. The main motif has kind of this it's like a propulsive thing. And then a lot of it has to do with instrumentation as well. You know, a lot of instruments of the orchestra summon the idea of soaring very well. You know, when you get those violins, classic orchestration tricks. I was brought into the process relatively late in the game, and so I didn't have a lot of time, which in a way was probably a good thing because it meant I had to get creative fast. I, I did spend a lot of late nights locked in my room, just sitting at my piano, noodling, like playing around, trying out different things. And so out of one of these long late night improvisation sessions came the 16 bars that are the main theme of Sonio di Volare. Civ is the very first video game that I ever wrote music for. In fact, Baba Yetu was the very first piece of music for a video game I'd ever written. It took me an entire week just to write. I mean, I threw out lots and lots of different drafts, right? But I wanted to really get it right. The themes to Civilization IV and Civilization VI have the same sort of celebratory feel to them. But where Civilization IV was a Swahili setting of the Lord's Prayer and it was very Africa-centric, this new one is very Eurocentric. You can absolutely play it safe musically, or you can be bold musically. Now that's a great way of phrasing it, actually, and I've never been one to play it safe. I, I really think that music can be divided into two camps. One is great music, and two is forgettable music. I've gotten my share of criticism that says, you know, like, my music is overly bombastic, or, or you know, various things, right? But on the other hand, I have my supporters who love my music for that specifically as well. The other way I know that I'm onto something good is my wife will come into the room and say, I like this. Because if I'm writing crap music or only so-so music, she'll just stay out in the living room or whatever. She won't wander in. But when you get the unsolicited feedback from someone where they voluntarily come in and say, oh, I, this does it for me, then you know you're onto something. Oh,